Hello and welcome to a new video. I got myself a new computer two weeks ago and after installing all the programs I needed to restore all my data to the new computer and I have been asking myself how to deal with OneDrive. Most of my data is actually in OneDrive, the cloud synchronization service from Microsoft and when you install the OneDrive client or it's pre-installed on Windows 10 as a standard, the default setting is files on demand. So when this checkbox is ticked and that's the default, files are only synchronized to your computer when you open the file or you explicitly say download the folder. So as you can see here, my local OneDrive folder, the status of uh, all the folders here is with this cloud symbol here. So this means they are currently not on my computer, they are on the Microsoft servers and they only got downloaded when I open them. However, I want to have all my data on my computer because Microsoft maybe cancel my account or something like that. So I want to be safe and have everything on my computer. The easiest way to do that is untick this checkbox here and everything gets downloaded from the internet to my local computer. However, this is a very time consuming process because uh, my OneDrive folder is currently 156 gigabytes of size. So I've been asking myself, can't I just copy over the OneDrive folder from my old computer to the new computer or via network and without mixing up the synchronization status and having all the files uploaded again? And this is my question. And so I tried it out. And the short answer is yes, you can absolutely do that. Let's do an example here and copy for example this folder here, the wiki folder, and paste it over here uh, to my local disk drive. So let's paste it here. Now it's calculating the and now he's asking us, do we want to replace the files on the local machine? And I was, um, I was, uh, the fear was that I overwrite something, but it's uh, not the case. You can just enter uh, or click replace the files in the destination folder. Then the files get copied over to your local hard drive. And then the Microsoft client, the OneDrive client checks it. And as you can see, there's sometimes here's a small sync symbol on the taskbar icon. However, it detects that there are no local changes to the file and does not re-upload the file. So that's a very, very easy way to migrate your OneDrive folder to your new PC. Just copy over the files and overwrite the files that are not yet on your PC. So it's very uh, time uh, more time efficient, especially when you have a large OneDrive folder. So just copy it over. Okay, well, that's it.